for the course of the trip. The flat four shown in black with 24 page 2.6. The course of the trip is described in the 1435 page 548. The Christian McKay therein being incorporated in by this reference book at Alpha Lions Ridge Road, cash in 2015 and 2016. We are hoping to do it at $604.38. 604.38. If you have any better. 604.38. Go on one. Going twice, hearing none for carrying the body sample up to bid. File number 59, that parcel number E19Z038, defendant 5 8 Henry Hughes, current property owner 7875. Looks like the county's going to buy a lot today. <laughs> Yes, this is in Mile Floyd County, Georgia. Map parcel number C13038, defendant 5A, Conway Shannon. Current property owner, same as defendant 5A. Reference fee 1310494. Property description on only that parcel land is tax parcel C13038, lying to be in landlot 106 of the 15th land district, 46 of Floyd County, Georgia. Being lots 24 and 25 builders home plan of service, shown in flat book 5, page 113. Graduate Depot 1310, page 494. Which is contained therein being incorporated here by this reference, known as 7365 Alabama Highway Southwest. Texas due 2015 to 2016. Hogan bid is 70203. $702.03. We're having any bidders. 70203. Going once. Going twice. Three nine. We're carrying by the same. Open bid. File number 97, Matt Parson number L17135, defendant 5A, Elliot, Adam, and Denise. Current property owner, same as defendant 5A, reference fee 2385349, property description on only that parcel, and that is tax parcel L17135, lying and being in landlock 211 with 22nd, 3rd, 2nd, County, Georgia, being property described in Depot 2385, page 249. Contained therein being incorporated here by this reference located off of Pleasant Valley Road. Tax year is due 2015 and 16. The bid is $533.16. 53316. Yeah. Got a bid for the opening bid. 53316. Any other bidders? 53316. Going on. Going on twice. So for the opening bid, you'll step up and get some information from you, please. Alright, we got file number 102, map parcel number M11X328, defendant 5A, Everett Arnold, current property owner, same as defendant 5A, reference team 176468, property description, all in all, that parcel is a parcel, M11X328, line of being landlock 25, the 23rd section, 3rd section, New South Georgia. Grab the deep book 176, page 468. Chris McCain, therein being incorporated here by this reference located on Old Calhoun Highway. Tax year 2, 2015 and 2016. Funding bid is $573.14. $573.14. Have any better? Go on once. Go on twice. Go on nine. Go on twice. Go on twice. Go on twice. Go on twice. Go on Matt Parson number N10075A, defendant 5A, Haggard, Grover C. Life Estate. 
Turner property owner, Haggard for Oversee, Life Estate, and David Raymond Haggard, the maintenance. Reference date 216359. Property description all in order that parcel right there today is tax parcel N10075A. Lying and being in landline 1923 language, the third section of Floyd County, Georgia, containing 2.41 acres, more or less, being tracked to, described in detail, 2162, page 590. <coughs> Between Taylor and being incorporated here by this reference, located on Shamrock Lake. Tax years due 2015 and 2016. Only bid is $786.24. $786.24. Have any bid? Go on. Go on twice. And I'm for the camera. Yep, bid. Don't want to get into it. File number 192. Not parcel number J13P159. Defendant Price A. Johnson, Eugene L. and Jesse. Current property owners Johnson, Eugene L. and Jesse Johnson. Stayed in room all areas known and unknown. Reference fee 908 463. Property description on one of that parcel land designated tax force J13 159. Lying and being in the city of Rome. Boy County Board will be in the southern half of lot 118. Described in the deep of 908, page 463. Contain there and being incorporated in by this reference known as 106 Wadsworth Street, tax years due 2015 and 2016. Opening bid is $636.36. Yep. For the opening bid, $636.36. Any other bid? Okay, so that was the tax sale. Now, this lady is starting to call a foreclosure sale. 
2483, page 632, Floyd County Georgia Records. He made the abstract property secured note in the original principal amount of $281,600 with interest there on a set fourth area. This is the Fort Oak, Floyd County, Georgia. Fort Safe Place may be locally designated as a punitive with an illegal act. On the first Tuesday in May 2017, the following is dropped from. So she's calling some foreclosure now. All that tractor parts of landline have been the city of Cape Spring, Floyd County, Georgia, being more quickly described as follows. The beginning point commenced at the southwest corner of the intersection of Riverstead, 40 foot right of way, and Broad Street, 40 foot right of way. Run then saw the bearing at 441 degrees, 12 minutes, 0 degrees, seconds east. The distance of 47.04 to a point located on the north right of way line of Riverstreet and the point of beginning for the track here at the bay. Running this north 0 degrees, 0 4 minutes, 22 seconds east. This is a 203.14 foot point. Running this north 89 degrees, 30 minutes, 0 seconds west. This is a 203 feet to a point. Running this south 0 degrees, 4 minutes, 54 seconds west. This is a 203.88 feet to a point. Located on the north right of way line of Riverstreet and running this south 89 degrees, 39 minutes, 39 seconds east along the north right of way line of Riverstreet. This is a 203 160.1 feet from point of beginning. The above described property is particularly shown in accordance with a plat survey made by Albert H. Engel, registered surveyor dated June 26, 1997, recording deed book 24, page 259. The desk request said security has been hereby declared due to the responsible to default trade to pay the debt as has been due in the manner provided in the security deed. The debt remaining default, this sale be made for the purpose of paying the same and all expenses of this sale as provided security by law, including attorney's fees. No specific place attorney's fees have been given. Said property will be sold except to the outstanding ad valorem tax, including taxes that the lien will not yet be unpayable. Any matters which might be disclosed by an accurate survey and dispatch the property, the assessment please come to this zoning orders, restrictions, covenants, and matters of record, security to security first set out above. To the best knowledge and belief of the undersigned, a party in possession of the property is Tom Sage Care and Diane Care or Tenor Tennis. Said property is more commonly known as 6 River Street, Southwest Cape Spring, Georgia, 30124. This sale will be conducted subject to the There is the address. Did you hear that? US Bank to Code. 6 River Street. And audit of the status of the loan with public security. U.S. Bank National Association as trustee for NRC Pass Through Trust 5 as attorney in fact for Thomas H. Care and Diane Care. All right, the opening bid for 6 River Street, Southwest Cape Spring, Georgia is $162,000. Do I have any bid? $162,000 going once, going twice, sold back to the land. And that was a foreclosure sale. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get you to be a witness for me? Yeah, I'll sign it. All right. I'm not buying this. Six. <laughs> <laughs> you have to, you're not buying it. And it. She has to have a witness that says that she called it out at the county steps, right? Yeah, right. Your signature so, print and your phone number. I'm just signing just, that I was here. Will you hold it for me? <laughs> just so nobody can come and say she wasn't there. Oh, people who miss the sales, we'll just they'll try things like that. I was there, but she wasn't. Huh? Yeah, she was. No, I think you did a good job of crying yeah, out. And phone number. Thank you. I'm I've seen here to learn. It was to like learn? A, yeah, well, I've never been to one before. It's been interesting. Yeah. Well, you got a good day for it. It's not hot. Oh, no, it's a fabulous day to learn. Yeah. It's a beautiful day. Okay. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Thank you. You got another one? Not for here. All righty. Not for here. I appreciate it. Y'all have a great day. Absolutely. All right. I know. I'm here to learn, too. I've never been to a Georgia sale. Okay, oh, really? so. <laughs> no, I've done Tennessee sales, but not a Georgia I've one. I've been to a Tennessee, but I've done Georgia for years. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be back. Okay, so we did a tax sale, and you saw the attorney, the tax assessor, I don't know exactly who he is, but he just stood up on the steps and said, this property, this is the legal description, this is what we actually know it's called, and this is what it owes. Does anybody want to pay this, or do you want to pay any more? And out of what, the 10 or 12 that he sold, only two or three had any bids, and out of the three that had bids, only two of them actually bid like an auction. All right, and then you saw the lady do the foreclosure sale. That's how a foreclosure sale happens on the courthouse steps. It's not that exciting. It's not like a regular auction. So now you don't have to leave work and you get to see what a tax sale and a foreclosure sale looks like. <laughs> it's been an educational day, huh? Y'all let me know if you have any questions. See you later.